In this video, I'm gonna show you how to add the whip pan transition to your videos in Adobe Premiere Pro. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so we have our sequence in Adobe Premiere Pro. So I have this sequence with this shot and this shot. So we wanna make that a little bit more interesting. So firstly, what we're gonna do is go to the project bin or the project panel. We're gonna right click, go to new item and adjustment layer. Making sure that the adjustment layer is the right dimension. So 1920 by 1080, 25 frames, square pixels, that's great. Press okay. Now we've got our adjustment layer here in our project tab. So what we need to do is right click on the adjustment layer and go to speed duration. Now here what we wanna do is set it from five seconds to eight frames. Now I'm doing that because I'm working with 25 frames per second. If you're working with 60 frames per second, for example, maybe set it to 20, 20 frames. I'd say as well, if you're working with 50 frames, like if you're working in the UK, you're working with PAL, maybe set it to about 20 as well. So we have our adjustment layer and we're gonna drag it onto the timeline. Use this little bar just to make the timeline bigger. Okay, so you can see what we're doing. And we're just gonna put that in the center, okay? So you can do that by holding, if you select the actual adjustment layer, if you're on a Mac, you can hold option and press the directional arrow on the keypad to move it to your center frame, okay? So now we've done that, what we need to do is go to the effects bar here and we need to type in push, okay? Now you can find that under video transitions, slide and push. So we're gonna grab the push and drag that transition onto the two clips, okay? So now it's created the transition between those two clips. With that selected, we're now gonna to go to the effects control and in the duration, we're gonna change it to the same settings that we had for our adjustment layer. So the duration will do eight frames. So just type in eight and press enter. Now it's eight frames. And just make sure that the alignment is center at cut. So if you hit the drop down, then you can change that, but make sure we have that selected, which it is, which we're okay with. Now, what we need to do on the adjustment layer is if you go to back to the effects tab, we're gonna type in blur. Now we can just go and select the directional blur and put that on our adjustment layer. Okay, now in the effects control panel for once you have your adjustment layer selected, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down to directional blur and change the direction to 90. Press enter. Okay, so we have this transition happening now. And now we go to blur length and change it from zero to 100. If I play back the clip, we now have a nice whip pan transition. Check out this video on how to add a flash effect to your videos in Adobe Premiere Pro, or check out this video you might enjoy as well. Until next time, this has been Aston Regis, helping you tell your story through video. Peace.